The inspector general released body camera videos of when police arrested Nicholas Gombardella after first confronting him at a Burger King parking lot in Brantford. That led to a multi-town police pursuit on I-95 South. At the Burger King, police blocked off Gombardella's car. He ended up driving away, crashing into two police cars, and driving onto I-95 South. Gombardella crashed at the end of a exit ramp and ran off. East Haven Police Department Lt. Joseph Finoia can be heard yelling I'll expletive, kill you. Get down on the ground. Before firing three shots at Gombardella, who then falls to the ground. Klarman then grabs for Gombardella while he is on the ground and officers took him into custody. You boys like Mexico! Yeah! Terrible customer service. I don't who the pregnant miserable life hating manager is that was on duty last night, but she needs to be fired. She has the most nastiest customer service ever. What happened to this place? Branford is such a nice place to live, but now they are letting any and everyone work in this town. Well, excuse me, princess. A DeKalb County Burger King failed a health inspection for things like outdated food and a dead roach. Channel 2's Sophia Choi visited Burger King on North Druid Hills Road this week, where they failed their most recent inspection with a score of 56. Although the restaurant still had its previous score of 81 up, which is a violation for not placing their current failing score for customers to see. Harold Chambliss, a DeKalb County resident who was visiting the store, said he appreciated Channel 2's reviews of restaurants failing health inspections. I asked for a bacon king without a bun, and onion rings. This is what I got. They only gave me one patty when it should have been two no mayo or ketchup and for some reason cover the whole burger in lettuce and tomatoes? That isn't even supposed to come on the burger. Then they didn't even give me the onion rings I ordered. And these special education students want $15 an hour? A young woman who was gunned down last year while working behind the counter at a Burger King in East Harlem is being honored with a street co-naming. Crystal Baron Nieves was killed one year ago at the fast food restaurant on 116th Street and Lexington Avenue. I would never go to this location again. It was disgusting. Not the company's fault, but people were coughing everywhere. One guy had shot hanging out of his nose, just hanging there, and he was sprawled out on the counter. Yeah! <laughs>